Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve the error address unreachable in Google Chrome. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I recommend doing would be if you're using a VPN or a proxy server, I recommend turning it off and see if the problem persists. So open up the search menu and type in VPN. Best match, you'll come back with VPN settings. Go ahead and open that up. If a VPN is connected and turned on, I recommend turning them off. So just toggle into the off position. And then attempt to launch the web page again and see if that has resolved the problem. Something else we could try here as well would be to open up the search menu. Type in CMD, best match. You'll come back with command prompt. Right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, type in IP config, space forward slash flush DNS. Flush DNS should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard. Should come back with Windows IP configuration. Successfully flush to the DNS resolver cache. Now you want to go ahead and type in NETSH space WinSock, W-I-N-S-O-C-K, space reset. Again, exactly how you see it on my screen. Hit enter on your keyboard. Should come back with successfully reset the WinSock catalog. You must restart the computer in order to complete the reset. Go ahead and close out of here and then restart your computer. And hopefully that should have been able to resolve your problem at this time. If you are still experiencing an issue, you can attempt to clear the Google Chrome cache. So open up the Chrome web browser, select the three dotted icon up in the top right. You want to select more tools and then select clear browsing data. Time range, select all time and make sure cached images and files is checkmarked. The other ones are optional and select clear data. And then once that's done, go ahead and close out of here and then relaunch the Chrome browser. And hopefully your issue should have been resolved at this point. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.